Night Elf against Orc. This is my favorite Night Elf based matchup. You know why? It's kind of like suffering from other people's bad driving and then letting your unholy road rage unleashed on someone else. Not that I do this. This is unsafe. You shouldn't. But you know, you've been mistreated all day on the road. You've been mistreated by your boss. As you know, those that know me know I have a lot of experience with this. And you suddenly have a chance to really stick it to the man. To get them back. A vindictive revenge. I've suffered so much at the hands of Night Elf. As an orc player. That you would think that my empathy for orc runs so deep that I couldn't possibly beat my own race. But what does it say about me that I enjoy the evil of giving orcs a bad time? I've always enjoyed it because it happened to me. I hope I'm not the only one that feels that way. Let's go Keeper of the Grove into Demon Hunter and Talons. And I like to think I'm only like that in a game. I think so. It's true. Thanks for the subs, guys. Only in the game. Because is it not true that games allow us to live out the fantasies? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Isn't it true that through games we can live out experiences that we otherwise wouldn't? I think that's the beauty of games. You know, like being a paladin in a Dungeons and Dragons setting and smashing evil and punishing injustice that's why we like games doesn't mean i don't say gohf that goes too far so let's try to play like moon we just casted his game let's just let's just play like him just play like moon so it's a it's a delayed headhunter Attack. We're gonna go get level two. Our sacred grove is being desecrated. Oh that's not that's not like moons, bro. We're gonna bring a wisp. Uh of course this is not he's not playing like Lin. Because Lin went for Blade Master. So everything's going to be a little different. The time is now. Our sacred grove is being desecrated. Command. Oops. Okay, that was uh, embarrassing. Is is he's going to live? Okay, okay. Now, I think we don't need to go Huntresses at all against the Headhunter Rusher. He's bit off more than he can chew. I don't even need to entangle. Mama said life is like a box of chocolates. Do we get this? Yeah. Let's get the tall priest. Do I think Keeper of the Grove is too strong? I think he's just as strong as he needs to be to inflict maximum suffering on orcs. You know, we can end the game. There's no way he can hold a level 3 keeper attack after that start. Let's go for a 2-in-1 game. Entangle level 2. We pick up basically a second hero. We bring all of our wisps and the game is over. 
There is no possible way for him to hold. Do you have a map editor sold with the Reforged version? I'd like to buy the game for creating maps. Yep. It's all in. GG. Oh. There ain't no way. Maybe we should give Sobi to Fire Lord. Give him some extra mana. Does this work on demolishers? No, it doesn't. Got the keeper. Just have to kill this. What the? F I gave him an abolish command. Not to heal. Catapult. Is he dying to Treants? I think so. Yep. Nice. GG. Let's go for a second. Night Elf OP. One less Orc player. Job complete. I hit that Orc right in his burrow. Yeah. I especially liked attacking his burrow in the back. But I had to attack the burrow in front first. But he knew it was about to happen and that's why he GG'd out. Minus one friend, yeah. Wow, very strong attack. How to defend orc? Impossible. It is possible to defend. But you need a little bit stronger start than that. He did a feral spirit harass and didn't keep me in my base. And then, yeah, he ran his TC into us. Went for two buildings, one bestiary and one lodge. And the bestiary didn't come into play. Didn't make anything out of it. His 45 burrows were late. He didn't read the room. So here's what he can read. One, I didn't stop making wisps. 
Uh, sorry, I didn't stop making archers. Number two, I lost wisps. So where does that push me towards? What story does that tell? It tells that I don't have wood and I do have many units. So what am I going to do? I don't have good late game because I don't have wood. So either I go talents or hippo riders, which don't need lots of wood. I can't go dryads or bears. So he doesn't need bestiary because, you know, he doesn't need Kodo against mass archers or something. Raider is not good against mass archers. You just need grunts. Headhunters maybe to get the range unit. But basically he needs grunts or headhunters. So, you know, if I go hippo riders, he should scout for it. And then he needs headhunters. If I go mass archer, he can switch to grunts. Uh, I have dispel requirement because, you know, I have treants and entangles so he can get some shamans. And because I'm likely going all in, I have no late game. I lost five wisps. He can get, uh, he can get more defenses now, like fortified, because he knows I kind of have to attack. So we'll see how this guy does. I don't know if we're going to play like the same way. Because we don't know if he's going to play the same way. If it is Blade Master, we'll just play something like uh, Druids of the Talon. Like the Moon Lin game that we casted recently. But if it's Farsi or Headhunters, maybe we do the same thing, Mass Archers. Why you made Ancient of War in this space? No, ancient, no protectors? Oh, because I didn't have Hunter's Hall. So I didn't have the prerequisite to build APs. APs would be better for the most part, because they have the range. But again, I would need Hunter's Hall and I chose to funnel all my money into Ancient of Wonders, Ancient of Wonders items. Hey Grubby, off game topic, is Baldur's Gate 3 worth the $60 price tag? Uh, absolutely, Lado. And did you try co-op? Yeah, I did. I tried co-op and it is very fun if you play with someone that has the same game understanding and level and you can go at the same pace and you are on the same wavelength in terms of enjoying games like that. So yeah, I think it's absolutely worth 60. I think it's worth 100. And I'm about to play soon and I upload all my Baldur's Gate 3 content on youtube.com slash grubby place in case you were wondering for, to, to whom it may concern you know games haven't got a lot more expensive when you look at single price tags like $60 I remember 20 years ago games were $60 that makes them cheaper now The only games that got way more expensive is the ones that have a battle, like six battle passes per year. And death costs are up? Yeah. Let's get level two and then we go into the map. Ah, oh, it's blades. Perfect. So we can play talents. Less than three. Hey, thanks a lot, uh, Steve. Appreciate it. Did he say GOHF? No, okay. We're, we're cool. Nature is restless. Nature is restless. I think we can go kill some uh, peons. Uh, we could expand, like Moon. Why not? We've got him in his base. No dust, so we can just hide. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. Waiting on you. The time is now. Waiting on you. 
two peons and we didn't lose tp so we are basically on the benchmark of moon two peons but we didn't lose tp not bad limited opportunities to visit you here mr grubby you lured me with your stream title cheers and best of luck today ah uh, thanks a lot dude Kumudosh him. Hope you are having a good life. Look, he's gonna go for the Ogre Mage. And he already used his dust for no reason on my Keeper. Ah, we came too early. Not usually a problem I have. But I got the timing wrong. Four archers should be enough. Go for the Ogre Mage. Ultra Vision, improved bows. If at any time during this next test you hear a tree speak, I remind you that a tree, in fact, cannot speak. At the end of the test, you must euthanize your tree of eternity. I must euthanize my tree? That's no good. Let's start making huntresses. Move our tree. GLaDOS, you crazy. Let's creep this small camp first. He's still here. Okay, then we can just creep this immediately. Because we've uh, spent enough time here waiting that the tree of life already arrived. Thanks, James Peated. Forgot to say. Oh! Thanks, Blade. He took my item. Hey, nicely done by him. Let's see what he's doing with his Shadow Hunter. Heal scroll. Where is his shadow? Maybe creeping the orange spot. We can get heal scroll and then. Uh, I don't know if we want to pressure yet. Shadow is level 2. Yeah, let's do heal scroll. Looks easy enough. Don't even have to look at the fight. And he has not got a counter expansion. Man, I love making orcs feel bad. I have suffered. I have suffered so greatly, guys. Now it's time for you to suffer. Oh, 
The tangle was buffed and then it was nerfed. Hey, as long as he hasn't got an expo, we're good. Is there danger? I stand ready. Nature is restless. Command the time. Just need to get Alchemist level 3. These fights hurt. He's gonna try to get expo now. We should we should delay it at all costs. Hey, we delayed Expo a lot, that's so worth it. Even though it cost us a lot of consumables, health, mana and whatnot, and we lost units. I feel like that was really worth it. Hopefully it's true. Now we just need Alchemist 3, and if we can get so without losses and it, we are actually going to be losing things because he's already attacking us so that's not gonna work oops not exactly the no losses dream yes slay orc slay do it! You got it. I'm cheering for him. This is great. I love it. I'll shake that right up. Care for a cocktail. Wanna blow something up? Care for a cocktail. Orc best race. More lumber. More lumber is required. I need some more lumber. Our sacred grove is being desecrated. I'm a Can we uh, pursue? Should we? Maybe we just creep. We have a good situation to creep. Man, I am playing amazing. For a five year old. Which is still one year older than the average night elf. The time is now. The wilds. We can't build them.
No, no steal, no steal, no steal. Good. Oh god, here he is. Our warriors have engaged us. I'm so glad he won. GG. <laughs> oh man. That was pretty good for for him. <laughs> GG, sub to the grub.